I call myself the accidental entrepreneur. You have to be a street fighter. Tick, 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 tick. We didn't know what we were doing. Silicon Valley. Technical breakthrough. hundred thousand dollars. million dollars. Ten billion dollars. Intel. Apple. Genentech. Cisco. Good markets. Great companies. Growing companies. Sky's the limit. The rest is history. The company was started with $250, and so we never had any money. But you have to be brave. These are very fragile companies with a lot of things missing. Any new business seldom does what's written in the business plan. The risks were just enormous. You could walk down the street in 1976 and talk to 100 people and say, would you like a personal computer? And they'd go, well, what's that? Jobs and Wozniak came up to see me, and they were very unappealing. They were bearded. They didn't smell good. They dressed funny. Yeah, well. But Woz had designed a really wonderful computer. I was convinced it was a big market just embryonically beginning. And when you see it, you know it. It's just that it just goes right through your bones. At the time we started Genentech, there was no such thing as genetic engineering. I said, what if God or Darwin won't let us make a new life form? But we had our breakthrough. It was a new idea, but it was a good one. If they hadn't stayed together, probably there'd be no silicon in Silicon Valley. Well, isn't it great if you can make money and change the world for the better at the same time?